Hello, and welcome back to, well, you know, that thing that we do sometimes. Anyway, this is Sydney, back in the Dragon Age 2 world, and I just opened it up, the video, I opened it up on this page so you could see what quest we're doing. Hi, Dustin. We're doing Prime Suspect first, because these ones are, like, more central to the plot. We're gonna do that one next, but we're gonna do this one first. Okay. So let's get our peeps. Oh yeah, we gotta change our peeps because we don't really need Anders and Varric around. We just had them so that we could go to the Fade and still have two friends to fight with us and not just one friend because that's kind of sad. So let's get our people back. Our lady people. Yeah. Lady party, it's a party. We're gonna go out. We're gonna go to the gallows. The spooky gallows with the creepy slave statues. Cause that's that's the the place we need to go. Oh, I forgot, Dustin. I was gonna tell you a joke but I can't remember it now. You're gonna hear this like every single time that we play. But my dad told it to me the other day and I, now I can't remember it, so I'll just ask my mom and then I'll tell you. Ah, you must be Hulk. Thank you for coming on such short notice. This guy looks different than I remember. Is there something I can help you with, Henry? I've been looking into the murders of several women for the past few years. Mm. I now believe these women were abducted and killed by the same man, Gaspard Dupuis. The French name, huh? If anybody sounds French, that means they're from Orlais, because Orlais is like the Frenchy place in this in this game. I meant French hyphen Y, French-ish, not like a derogatory name for a French person. Is this man in hiding? Am I to find him for you? No, I know where Dupuis is. I just can't get to him. When I became convinced of his guilt, I went to the city guard and demanded that they do something. My men raided that house. There was nothing, and I've heard no end because of it. You were reprimanded, I hope. Yeah, that was awkward. Meredith forbade me from continuing my investigation, but she didn't say I couldn't seek outside help. Okay, that makes sense. What have you learned about Gaspar Dupuis? He's a reclusive nobleman who's rarely seen outside his estate in Hightown. He knew two of the murdered women and made inquiries about the others. Mm. It cannot be a coincidence. Mm. Okay. It should be investigated at least. Thank you. I face nothing but ridicule. To hear someone say that is... Encouraging. Oh, that's, I like being encouraging. What do you need me to Said Kaisen. I knew I could count on you. Oh. You'll need to go to Gaspard Dupuis' estate after nightfall. Please figure out what Dupuis is hiding. Dupuis. If he's innocent, find evidence to prove me wrong. I really don't like his... It's name. just that simple. This guy, like the last time I played this game, I don't remember him being such a... Oh, you know what I just remembered? I forgot to set my timer, Dustin. Let me just set a timer so I don't go over the time. Because I want to be on time for you. Gotta be on time. I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna take two videos today because I'm feeling fun and fancy free. All um, week I've supposedly been working on my novel, so I did a bunch of outlining, you know? Yeah, I did a bunch of outlining and then I was- ooh, we've got a letter! I did a bunch of outlining and then I was like, I should have some fun, so I'm gonna do some Dragon Age. Um, what was I gonna tell you? Oh yeah. So this quest, Gascard Dupuis slash the person who's Hello, killing women. A new letter on your desk awaits your attention. 
It's, um... Maybe I'll tell you later. I, I think I will. Okay. I have noticed your considerable talents and have an opportunity that may be of interest to you. Meet me in Hightown at midnight. Discretion is key. A new friend. I don't even remember this from my last playthrough, so we'll just see what happens, won't we? Let's see what it shows up as in my quest. The midnight meeting. <laughs> Okay, let's do that. Why not? That's fun. Anyway, there's a quest in the first act that we didn't choose to do. That will be slightly related to... Oh, look at Isabella's little armband. Because we had sex with her! <laughs> I forgot about that. Oh my goodness, okay. Um, wow. Sorry, I'm really mentally distracted right now. Midnight meeting, we have to make it nighttime. Dustin, I'm really scattered. Very sorry. Oh my gosh. So I've been thinking about you a lot because of your thing on Tumblr about how, not Tumblr, on Facebook about how your dog ate rocks. Poor baby. I mean, the outside of your house is so deep. Oh, you guys, stop having conversation. Anyway, and especially that, like, since she's so small, the rocks were basically sand. I think that's really funny. Um, <laughs> anyway, but I don't know if you can hear me very well, so I might have to wait until I'm just fighting. I love fire. <laughs> Enemies we're fighting are called Invisible Sisters, and they are like... From the Chantry, I think? That's what they're called sisters, because they're like... Also kick ass. Make, make you drink a potion. It better. It better. Oh. Dustin, I cannot like describe to you how tired I am right now. Fire! Someone come over here. Got some fire for you. So the reason why I was thinking about your dog... Oh no! <sighs> okay, now, finally, someone still might pop up because these invisible sisters, they like, are, um, a lot of them are like rogues, so they can like poof out of existence and then poof back behind you and stab you, which is quite fun. That's trash, I don't want it, gross. leveling up and I'll tell you about my cat. James and I had a chicken which we put into 
something we cooked, but we bought a pre-cooked chicken, like a rotisserie chicken. And, um, um, we were like, oh, the wishbone. Last time we got a rotisserie chicken, the wishbone broke, right? So we got a rotisserie chicken this time and we were really excited about the wishbone so we set it out to dry. And then last night, several days after the chicken, several days, okay, like, <sighs> I'm like in, still in disbelief. Several days later and I hear this clicking sound like Pup is chewing on something that's clicking against the floor and I'm like, what the fuck is that? And of course it's the fucking wishbone. He like found it and just played with it and it all it was was like the little joint the part between the two legs that's all that was left <laughs> and I was like you gotta be kidding me and so now I'm like really worried that you know he's gonna start pooping blood and die because he's got chicken bones stabbing into his intestines but I don't actually know if he ate any of it or if he just like you know chewed it into pieces and then was like, oh, whatever, you know? I don't- ooh, moonshine, that's kind of cool. I want that. Anyway, I don't know if he actually did that or, you know? I don't know if he just played with it. I wonder who's meeting me in the dark. Let's see. Oh yeah, I think it's like a trap. You came. Oh no, it's some old lady? Who are you? You probably thought you'd got away with it. So Karas and the others' deaths. Oh. Do you even remember them? I honestly they don't. They were searching for the missing Starkhaven apostates and were murdered. Did we murder them? An inquiry determined the apostates must have killed the Templars. But I've suspected for years that Sir Thrusk and you were responsible. This explains why I'm confused, because I think in my other games, I don't think I killed the Templars, but I think you and I did because we were just super pissed. I mean, I don't want to say that. I want to say this one. I'm just like, she's obviously here because she wants to kill me, though. This seems kind of me like not mean, but antagonizing. So you're here to beat a confession out of me. That's snarky. I don't need a confession. Yeah, she's just gonna try. My brothers. Yeah. Tonight, justice will be done. She has cool eyes, though. Quack, quack, quack. Okay, ready? Let's fight her and these six other Templars, I guess.
There we go. Yeah, so that's why I didn't know what was going on because I... Ooh, the tiny cut. Because, Aveline, please get out of the way. I'm trying to loot here without walking. Yeah, shield. This is some cool loot that I have never gotten before because I never did this quest. Oh, there's a dead person back there. Staff. Just a mysterious dead person. Probably one of the Templars. Oh, yeah, there's one too. Okay, that was fun. Great. Now back to our regularly scheduled programming. Okay, now I have to break into Gaskard's estate after dark and see if there's evidence that links him to the disappearances. Cool. Let's go this way. Hopefully we don't run into more. Um, I think I went the wrong way. Gotta go towards the Chantry. Oh, look at that. Go oh Later when we are not, like, actively fighting, I'll check out that shield and that dagger and I'll give them to my peeps. I bet Isabella could use a new dagger. She likes daggers because they're pointy and... Oh, hello. Let's go fight. There's gonna be more of these invisible sisters. Oh, I should have done this one for fire. More fire. Take that. time left to kick a bunch of butt, a bunch of demon butt. I think there will be some demons here. Some shades, one or two rage demons. It'll be fun, right? Oh, here they are. Hello.
killing on my friends. sometime. Never really thought of that. <laughs> I don't think the gods raid in the estate met that particular reception. Yeah, I feel like then this guy might be actually considered guilty. If people had come in and a bunch of demons had been like, hey guards. But no, he was laying low. We get the cavalry. Oh, the guards get to just chill. Makes sense. Ah. Okay, fire. Fire is effective. I just recently played this quest. Well, I it's not exactly recent, but I played it with um, my my character Delilah, who's who was romancing Fenris. Played this quest, and I I like made different choices than before because of just for fun. My inventory is full. Yeah, right. Can't be. Let's like delete all of this junk. How do we do that? Oh yeah, you know, in the <laughs> on the um destroy. Actually, I don't think I want to destroy that. Destroy because I can't. Well, I can't like use it. Yeah, destroy. There's this <laughs> goodbye bottle of moonshine. Um, there's this button you can press. It destroys all your- look at all this stuff I haven't been using. I put it in the junk and I just fucking forgot about it. Like, I, I haven't been doing this the whole time. I'll do it right after the end of the video. I just need to make room for some loot, you know? Right after the end of the video, though. I'm gonna have to delete all of that junk. You're supposed to do it periodically. And on the Xbox, there was one console button, one button on the controller, and I just deleted all of it. But on the computer, you have to, like, delete it one item at a time, which is the most ridiculous thing I have ever, ever had to do in my entire life. Delete the junk one item at a time. Come on. That's just the worst. Help me! Please! He's gone mad! This is suspicious. You're not... You're not him. Shit, I... I know what this looks like, but I didn't hurt her. Well then, let her go. Let her go, and we can talk. If I let her go, you'll kill me. Not I don't first. know why you're here, but there's a killer out there, and I think he's playing us both. Bum, bum, bum. Just... just let me explain. Plot twist. You don't have to be afraid. I'll hear what you have to say. Because I'm nice. Several years ago, my sister was murdered. The bastard's now in Kirkwall, killing again. The same way he killed my sister. It starts with a bouquet of white lilies. He sends them to each new victim. Alessa was going to be next. Poor Alessa. I took her, so he'd have to come to me. I was finally going to face my sister's killer, but then you showed up. I don't think the killer's dumb enough to come get Alessa while you're holding on to her. He hurt me! I've explained this. I need your blood to track you down. If he took you, it was for your protection. Oh, yeah. Let go of me! He's been using a teensy bit of blood magic. She goes straight to the city guard. They ruin everything. And that's why I killed him when I was playing the Fenris game, because Fenris doesn't like blood magic, so I was like, ooh, blood magic is bad. killed your sister? A powerful and experienced blood mage. I believe he uses the women for some ritual. His victims are attractive, healthy women with few social ties. Hmm. I mean, obviously he's afraid of the guards because they suspect him. And obviously he's a blood mage, so I'm not going to ask him stupid questions. 
I can help you track down your sister's kid. <laughs> no, I can't manage on my own. Oh, Gascar. I'm headed to Dark Town. If you learn anything new about the killer, find me there. Find me there. Have a score to settle with him. Aww. Isn't it funny that I'm like catching up to my friend in this game? <laughs> Isabella is not happy. Five isn't very much though. Rivalry five is okay. I wonder what her relationships thing is. Oh, it's pretty high because we, <laughs> once again, I'm reminded suddenly that we had sex with Isabella. That was fun. Okay, so he went to Dark Town. Alessa escaped. Wee wee wee. Sorry, I'm making myself dizzy. I think maybe there's some loot around here that I missed. But... Is it in here? Yeah, loot, 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 loot. Barrel. Yes. I love loot. Just kidding. That was a chunk. I suppose I could tell you about it because it doesn't really matter, but the, um, the quest in the first act where that guy was like, oh, my wife, she hates me and I can't find her, you know, and we thought, oh, she probably just ran away because he's clearly not very great to be married to, you know what I mean? So, like, if we do investigate that, instead of being like, you're a terrible person, I'm not going to help you. If we do investigate, then we go to a place, like, in the docks or the um, warehouses, you know? And and um, we find, like, I don't know, there's, like, a bunch of traps, you know? And there's, like, a bloody finger <laughs> in a pile of... I don't know. Anyway, there's like a, a severed finger and we're like, well, and it has her wedding ring on it. And then we're like, well, this is probably what happened to her, you know? And then if we take it back to the guy, you know, we have the option of giving him back her ring. And then he says, oh, you know, what happened? Did you find her? And we have the option of telling him, just let it go, you know, or telling him it was on her severed finger. <laughs> And if you tell him it was on her severed finger, then he's like, oh, now everyone's really going to think I killed her. And if you don't tell him anything, then he's like, okay, whatever. I guess I'll just go be a dick elsewhere for the rest of my life. Anyway, so that's a quest that we chose not to do. But it's related to this only vaguely, you know. Like she was one of the victims, you know. He, like, thought that she had, like, a lover, you know, because, um, she got some flowers, and he, and she went to the red light, the red lantern place, the blooming rose, that's what it's called, the blooming rose. Alright, tell Emmerich at the gallows that Gascard is not guilty, he probably should. Tell Emmerich the gallows. Cascar is not guilty. And then we're gonna have to stop the game for now. And we'll go on to the next video. <coughs> I haven't made a video since like that one I made when I was sick, which was like two or three weeks ago. <laughs> because I was sick. And then I had my period, and then I was sick again, and I was just miserable, like, the whole time. Oh, look, a different Templar. Aren't you Hawk? Enric left not long ago. He said you'd arrange to meet tonight. Hmm. Perhaps you're mistaken. I'm not mistaken. You sent him a message a half hour ago. Look. Oh, shit. I didn't send this. Oh. You didn't? Strange. Well, I don't know. Emmerich's been acting strangely for months. It's probably just a misunderstanding. Uh, helmet hair girl, you are incorrect. Beep beep. Too 
minutes. It says that we have two minutes left, Dustin. So I'm gonna end the video, okay? But then the immediately next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the place where Emmerich is supposed to meet us, okay? But obviously someone else sent that message. Who is it? I don't know. Probably something to do with the murderer. I sure love solving murders, don't you? Anyway, okay, so I'm gonna go and do some fiddling around with the junk and get rid of it and maybe equip Abilene a new shield because look at this shield she's got right now. It's just hideous. Look at that thing. Look at that. Ugh. Looks like it's made of dark spawn or something. Okay. Okay. Bye, Dustin, and I'll see you in the next video. Catch you later. Bye.